Hey, Surf fans! Welcome to an all-new episode of Ask Surf. I'm marie andré And I'm Amélie. In this video, we visit some of our artists around the world. Who will we meet this week? Stay tuned to find out in this episode of... Ask Surf! The question is from Melissa Audrey from Facebook, and she asks, My first Cirque show was over this year, and I absolutely loved it. Any chance you'll have any other shows in Columbus, Ohio? That's a good question for me because I actually performed with Ovo in Columbus the last time that you saw it, and I'll be coming back with Corteo from April 12th to 15th. Hi, my name is Otka, and I am the contortionist on Kusa. Joan X from Instagram asks, what made you start circus and was it difficult to get known as a circus artist? So I started doing contortions uh, when I was 8 years old and uh, there were definitely some challenges to get known but uh, when I was 10, Cirque du Soleil casting team came to Mongolia, my home country and uh, I did a casting and from there, uh, when I was 14, they called me and if, they, like, if I was available for this position on Kusa, so that's how I got to Turk to LA seven years ago. Uh, that will depend how many shows we have per day, so like today would be like two shows, so I would arrive here in the morning around 10.30, I would do musculation and conditioning for about, let's say, two hours and a half. Then if it would be a one show day, I would have one hour handstand, but then it's going to be a 20 minutes warm up when it's two shows. And then right before my act, I'll have another 10 minutes maybe. Then that would be it. Esteban Cespedes Miranda from Facebook asked, how do you choose the countries for your auditions and why it's not very usual in South America? Well, there's, our, there's very uh, multiple um, reasons why we, have, we decide to go on this place, on that place, depending on the rarity of the discipline depending on the specific needs of our shows. Uh, it depends also on the amount of, of artists in a specific place. But we would like, of course, to audition everywhere in the world. That would be our main goal, it's impossible. Uh, still, for South America, you have to know that since 2012, we auditioned nine times already. So we do go there. And uh, the best idea for you, if you want to, uh, to be visible from those auditions, is to send us material because we look at everything you send. Вообще я люблю много вещей по поводу работы в работы в цирке. Одна из них находится у меня за спиной. Это наш замечательный спортзал. Он уже наполовину упакован, но он нам всем очень нравится. Можно заниматься в любое время суток. Не нужно платить ни за что. Можно заниматься прямо на работе, совмещать приятное с полезным. Также мне очень нравится наша кухня. Кормят нас очень хорошо. И вообще работа в цирке очень классная, потому что можно путешествовать, можно следить за здоровьем и все это совмещать с работой. И есть еще масса привилегий и преимуществ этой работы. Alors, euh, ce que je préfère dans ce show, ça va être euh, la différence qu'il y a entre les acrobates et le mélange des différents types de skaters, que ce soit nous, les extreme skaters, c'est-à-dire les rampes ou même les figure skaters qui est complètement un monde différent. Et c'est tout le mélange de ces différentes personnes qui se regroupent dans un même show que j'adore. C'est vraiment top. Bon, bueno, les acrobates, nous avons une diète eh, balancée, équilibrée et nutritive pour pouvoir rendir à 100% en les shows que nous faisons semanalement. Mais basiquement, nous mangeons de tout. Si nous voulons manger des fruits, des verdures, des carnes, des pollo, eh, dulces, nous pouvons manger ce que nous voulons. Donc, c'est bon. Kev Michael 15 from Instagram asks. What are the names of the tents of the touring shows and how do you decide to name them? Yes, we really name our big cups. It's a tradition we've had since our beginning, 32 years ago, and our founder, Guy La Liberté, named all of them. Names are Alexis, Funambul, Gaia, Vivia, Elios. Our newest one has been named Millennia in honor of the youth and the energy of the new generation embodied in the show Volta. So we have a question from Alex Wu Kung Fu from Instagram. And he asks, do you guys have any auditions coming up for martial artists or other talents this year? 
We actually don't have any martial art auditions specifically coming up on the audition calendar for this year, but we do have extreme sport auditions and auditions for athletes. And frequently we ask martial arts artists to come and take part in those auditions. So keep a lookout in our audition calendar and check whether your discipline might be included in one of our future auditions. <laughs> Thank you guys for watching this episode of Ask Cirque. Comment below to let us know what you thought. Click here to see more Cirque du Soleil videos. Here for show tickets. And here to subscribe to our YouTube channel. And finally, don't forget to like and share this video with friends to flip their everyday reality the circuit. Where everyone, every day is extraordinary. <laughs>